deeply. I believe that there are a number of national assets uh, that are being poorly managed by the public sector uh, simply because we have a funding challenge, simply because there is a bureaucracy, simply because uh, there is a lot of corruption. Uh, so my sense is that anything that the private sector can run more efficiently than the public sector, by all means, it should be privatized, especially if we can generate some revenues in the process and help fund this, our large budget that requires funding. What government should typically do is to act as a regulator, as a supervisor, to ensure that these private sector entities, they play according to the rules. And when they step out of the line, they are appropriately sanctioned. So that really, in my view, should be the role of government, especially in a season where your revenues have come under pressure, you have made certain assumptions that you really don't have any certainty the degree to which those assumptions will be met. So I would say start from the point of the known before you venture into the unknown. So the known is we know what we have, we know how much we're even spending in terms of recurrent expenditure to keep those entities and agencies running. Why don't you save that money and actually channel it into critical areas, education, socials, you know, because uh, the misery index, as one analyst on this program typically says, that is very high. They say it is 56%, and that is a significant sum.